Let's factor the equation x squared plus 2x minus 8, and we'll use these guidelines here. First off, set up a skeleton equation. So I've already done that. Once you have your skeleton, you can add the signs. So I see I have a positive and a negative here. If the last term is negative, I'll put a positive and negative in my skeleton equation, like this. Next, I want to find the factors for the last term, this negative 8, and they should add up to equal the middle term, that 2 there. So the factor is for 8, and it looks like 2 times 4, that's 8, and the difference between 2 and 4, that's 2. So we need to figure out where we put the 2 and the 4. Let's put the 4 here and the 2 here, because x times negative 2, that's negative 2x. 4 times x is 4x, so 4x, negative 2x, that'll give us the 2x. But let's check our work here with the FOIL method. Multiply the first, outside, inside, and then last. That gives us, and we can combine negative 2 plus 4x, that'll give us the 2x. We have our negative 8, we have our x squared. This is what we started with. So we factored the equation x squared plus 2x minus 8 correctly. Let's take a moment and find the values for x here that when we put it back in the equation, we'll make this whole side of the equation equal 0. 0 equals 0, that's a true statement. So we say x plus 4 equals 0, add a negative 4 to both sides, x equals negative 4. Over here, x minus 2 equals 0, add a positive 2 to both sides, x equals 2. If you put 2 in for x, do the math, this side will all equal 0. Likewise, if you put negative 4 in for x and you do the math, this side equals 0 again. And if you use the quadratic equation, you'll get these exact same answers. This is Dr. B factoring the equation x squared plus 2x minus 8. Thanks for watching.